Alright guys, welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video and this one will be taking to the new EZA first form freezer. Initially I decided to just um, do a regular showcase, you know, showing them off on a few different teams, Wicked Bloodline, the Planet Namix Saga and then the Transformation Boost team. But since he's actually not link level 10, I'll just show you the link levels here. So um, yeah, his link levels are ranging from links 5 to 9. Um, I decided I can just do that um, separate team showcase or the regular showcase that I do when I get into link level 10. So for now we'll just take him into the Wicked Bloodline stage of Category Super Battle Road. Um, the only equip equipment piece or piece of equipment that he has is this um, level 10, sorry, level, yeah, sorry, the level 5 silver attack equipment. So it boosts him, his attack. Uh, I think when he's when he's attacking a physical type to level 10 to 15. Um, right, so I intend to actually link him up with this physical final form cooler. Uh, I will actually float the physical final form cooler here, and we will we'll do this. So we'll just have him attack the King Vegeta. We will have cooler attack, I think Bardock, and then we'll have the physical final form cooler attack the King Vegeta again. So I mean, yeah, I'm actually I've seen a few showcases of I've used the freezer myself. Um, it's actually quite impressive. As for what he does, I'll just pull up his stats for his information here. Right, so on his 12 key, he now greatly raises attack and defense for 110 and causes colossal damage to the enemy. And then on his 18 key, he causes mega colossal and greatly lowers attack and defense for the enemy. So compare that to what he was doing prior to his EZA. Quite the hefty improvement. Um, so on his 12 key, he didn't actually have any super attack effects, and then on his 18 key, he just lowered attack and defense. So he's gone a lot, lot stronger. So we'll have him in the first slot here. Uh, let's see what kind of links he shares with these two. So 90k defense with 192k attack stat, 186k with 98k defensive stat. So we'll have him linked with this metal cooler here. What I'll do is I'll target the King Cold, sorry, the King Vegeta, to make sure that the int easy on the at the end there, his passive, his guard passive remains. We'll have the cooler attack the King Cold, and then we'll also have the Freezer attack the King Cold. So what's the defense that? 98k. So as for his passive, uh, actually, let's just see how this turn plays out. So 42k, um. That's an okay amount of damage, 4.14, uh, quite a great attack stat considering it's not really his most favourable um, linking partner. And of course, um, he greatly lowered attack and defence, or greatly lowered King, v King Vegeta's attack and defence there. But yeah, as for what he does in his passive, he has attack and defence 50% at the start of turn. He then gains an additional 3 key, and 50% defence as a first or third attacker in the turn. And then he gets an additional 50% attack when performing an Ultra Super. And then finally to top it all off, he gets an additional 3 key when attacking Super Class enemies. Quite the improvement, to be honest. Um, we'll just leave it like this. I think we'll just use a Princess Snake as we can. We will do this. And I will do this actually instead. Yep, we'll just float that easy a freezer. Again, we'll just make sure that King Cold is dead. Sorry, I keep—I don't know why I keep saying King Cold. Um, King Vegeta is dead, and we'll go for this. Right. So yeah, I mean, as for the freezer, he's, he is actually greatly improved. I mean, he's putting out summonable LRs. Like his damage numbers and his defensive numbers are summonable, summonable LR level. I mean, I actually really like how they designed him and actually both the Goku, and I really like how they mirror each other well. The freezer, of course, gets stronger against super class enemies and of course the Goku gets stronger with extreme class enemies or when, he's, when they're facing extreme class enemies I should say for their um, respective opposite classes but yeah I mean um, as I said like the Freeze is not even linked level 10 here oh we've got the yeah, metal cool transformation not the greatest I think we'll just try and stall to try and show uh, one more turn of the Freezer but we should be for another two turns we'll try and save those STR orbs there Grab this. But yeah, I mean, this freezer, like, I'd want to say he's one of the best LRs in the game, one of the best units in the game. He's 
his kit is very well, uh, very suited to tackle the short formats of the game, so of course Super Battle Road. Um, but I mean, he is good enough himself to where I think he'll be fine in some of the longer events as well. I mean, he's going to have over 200k defensive stat, um, and that's just with his 18 key. If you manage to get lucky or you go for his 12 key, his defense will raise even higher. And not to mention that him having probably one of the best link sets in the game, he has strongest cloud in space, which is key 2, universal most malevolent, which is 20% attack, metamorphosis, which is 5% health, regen, and 10% to attack and defense. He has thirst for, conqu thirst for conquest, attack and defense 15%, big bad bosses, attack and defense 25%, fear and faith, another 2 key, and then legendary power, which is 20%, oh sorry, attack 15% when performing a super attack, so... He has one of the best link sets in like, the game, to be honest. Um, let's check his defensive stat here. 112k, pretty good, considering he's not in level 10. But of course, big bad bosses is active here, so we'll see how well he tanks. 44, 45. He's at virtually practically a 5 mil attack stat there, pretty good. But I think this will be the Freezer's only weakness, however, him just having to take hits before he attacks. Um, I wish they would somehow change the mechanic or the wording. Um, I know the AGL, LR, Goku, and Arale suffer from a similar issue where they need to attack before they get their defense um, buff active. Um, I wish it would just kind of calculate uh, when the final orbs have been chosen. So when the final slot, or when the unit in the final slot, when their orbs have been chosen, the game calculates. Oh, okay. Um, he's now attacking in the first turn, so he will get that defensive buff, but that's, it's not really an issue, to be honest. Um, Alright, so, another Metal Cooler transformation. I think one more thing I wanted to add is, I believe they talked about an adjustment to his super attack, and uh, I'm not sure if I'll actually have the audio, um, or if I record the audio here, but I believe the adjustments they made were, number one, the audio, and number two, the card animation, so when you use your fire the 18 key super attack, you'd have his art, his uh, LR art pop up, um, as you do, but I believe they've removed that now from his 18 key super attack, and they've also changed some of these sound effects and made them a bit more like, stronger sounding, or, I mean, you'll hear it in game, so when he fires his supernova, or when he's charging his supernova attack, it, it really sounds like, um, I feel like some of the sounds have been taken from the physical uh, angel golden freezer, the Dolphin Fish, which just released, um, I'm not sure where exactly, but some of the sound effects are very similar to that super attack. So I suppose that's where they've taken it from, which is okay. I mean, I was hoping for a, a full super attack revamp, um, but I just went for the adjustment, which is fine. Um, as for what he shares with the physical final form, cooler the links, because he has a decent amount of linking partners. So with the physical final form cooler, they share metamorphosis. Big Bad Bosses, Universe is Most Malevolent, Strongest Clan in Space, and Thirst for Conquest. Is that another turn for this cooler? This isn't meant to be the Metal Cooler shop, this is meant to be the Freezer shop. Yet. That's fine. So yeah, they share a decent amount of links. Of course, when you do get this Freezer to link level 10, him having free 25% attack and defense with the Big Bad Bosses link is pretty insane. Um, that's why him having a 100k defensive stat, yeah, it's it's honestly a bit of a liability, him having to attack first, but once he attacks, he's not really going to take any damage with the 50% defensive buff that he gets um, from his super attack, which is pretty insane. Well, that should be the Vegeta taken care of there, looks like we're attacking Nappa. I think as long as we keep the, I believe it's a Goku family category enemy alive, that Vegeta should have his passive, which he does, so I'll keep him in the first slot there. We will continue to attack, I think, Nappa. We'll just work our way down from there. And we'll grab this. Yeah, this freezer as well, this in final form freezer. Get him farmed up, because him having guard is he's probably like the number one unit you want to pick for this stage. He's that impressive, that insane. But yeah, I mean physical final form cooler links well with him. The LR King Cold and Mecha Freezer, they also link quite well with him. They don't have big bat bosses, but they share Universe's Most Malevolent, The Strongest Clan in Space, Thirst for Conquest, Fear, Fear of Faith, and Legendary Power. Pretty supreme good uh, linking set. And, alright, so here we go. 
So again, we look at the Eradicator. I'm actually just going to use a Sensor Beam, because we can. Of course, I'm not going to use any items. We would have got rid of big bad bosses there, but that's fine. We'll attack the Reddit. We'll have... We need to attack bandits as well, and we'll have him attack bandits as well. So this is the kind of attacks that he generates here. 3.6, oh, still pretty good considering that's not weak support. And of course his defense I believe is at what, 1900k, so oh, that's a lot of damage. It's just one shot. Alright, let's see how much this does. 262, so that's a lot of damage, but 20k, 20k that bad. Um, considering we didn't actually grab his 12 feet, which would have greatly raised his defense for one turn. Um, he's pretty insane though, 38k, I mean, you can see difference in tank in there. I know physical final control isn't the greatest anymore, but it's still pretty good considering he's free to play. I mean, comparing him strictly to someone like LR Jiren, I know my Jiren is only 55%, but um, he's able to generate what? Link with the God Topo has tax stats of 5.2. And a defensive stat of 200k. Of course, um, Jiren's 5.2 attack stat, or 5.2 million attack stat, I should say, quantifies higher when, when compared to the freezes because these are super, well, super effective against all types. So, <laughs> the 5.2 attack stat that Jiren's able to actually establish is closer to 8 million, I believe. 5.2 times 1.5 is 7.8 million. Um, so, you know, Jiren is better, but like this freezer, considering he went from pretty much unusable, generated good attack stats, but he severely had key issues and now he's able to pretty much generate 4 or 5 million attack stats turn 1 with 150-200k defense. Pretty insane. I think another unit I forgot to mention which links well with this freezer is the STR Cooler. I'm kind of, um, I think I should have actually grabbed a copy of the red coins when I should have. That, that would have been good. I think I'm just going to pop a sensor beam. Again, just to make sure that we don't instantly go into the Metal Cooler transformation the next turn, because we should have this stage finished off here. Let's see? Yep. This is a joke with this um, Final Form Freezer, it takes no damage. He lowers the attack of the enemy and then he raises his own attack, so pretty darn good. Go into this stage here. Okay, this is going to be a good showing, I think. I'm just trying to see, we should, we should probably lower the attack of... No one's actually had pace and type advantage except the Fuji himself, so... We'll have him lower the attack of this guy here. Yeah, unfortunately the key actually hasn't worked out the great, so... Actually this won't be a AT key super attack. Quite strange, because <laughs> usually the way the freezer works, you only need to get him at 12 key, so we are... One key shot. Still at 1.9 million. Pretty good. Okay, that's that's pretty good. 3k. Yeah, I mean, my current freezer. I'm pretty sure I showed before. He has 17 crit and six additional one and three dodge. Honestly, I'd probably change that myself to 15 additional, I think, and then 11 crit. Just the way I prefer my units. And the way this freezer is built, him having the ability to. Uh, greatly raises attack and defense for that one turn, it's pretty insane in my opinion. Um, once he's, of course, greatly um, lower the attack and defense of the enemy, so... Eh. He's so good, this freeze, I don't know. I don't know why that made him so good. I'll just pop this. And we will continue to lower this guy's attack. I'm gonna try and grab a Dolcom mod for the next turn. That's gonna activate it, isn't it? We'll just grab this one. Okay, so that's good, it'll be a good set for the next turn. Of course, this won't do any damage. We also have a damage reduction item active here. But yeah, get this freezer done. And <laughs> as for the STR cooler, they share metamorphosis, big bad bosses, universe's most malevolent, strongest clan in space, and the first for conquest. Honestly, villains since the link level update have seen such a huge increase. To where, like, for example, some of these boos, some of these cells, some of these freezers who had um, freezer cell boo specific links. They aren't they're all, those links now when you get them linked together with their respective linking partners they output so much damage all right so we'll go here it's four that's five doesn't really matter i think we'll just grab the sdr ops to get a bit of healing we'll go for this here to check freezer defense 92k pretty good we'll see how much he takes it i suspect he'll take 60k or something 121 
but still, like, it might seem like a lot of damage, but of course, you got to remember that the Freezer gains his defensive buff on super attack, or when he's attacking, so him taking that much damage isn't, I suppose, too bad. 4.4, is that what I said? I mean, I'm just surprised that he's able to hit these damage numbers and he's not even linked level 10. Imagine this guy with permanent big bad bosses. Like, he's going to hit insanely hard. How much damage is going to do? Oh, <coughs> finished it. Didn't even need to crit. Okay. Um, yeah, so that will be the end of this showcase here. I might take him into extreme SDR Super Battle Road. If you want to see that, let me know in the comments below. If you want me to take him to the legendary Goku event, again, let me know in the comments below. He's... I don't know what to say, like, uh, you see all the results for himself. Yeah, he takes a lot of damage before he um, attacks, but when he attacks, I mean, the Freezer himself, he just outputs so much damage. Just make sure to get this guy done, and the Prime Battle Goku. Uh, they, I mean, they are so good. I mean, they're too good. 